Hi guys, alrighty, so I kind of wanted, I, I feel like I fell off the face of the earth for you guys. It's been almost about a month since we did any videos and I have a very good reason why. No, I'm not pregnant, but if you follow us on Facebook, you kind of know kind of what's been going on. Uh, Maddie was released from the hospital January... I think. Oh, I can't remember offhand, but she was. It was beginning of January. Um, then I ended up getting really sick. Then I got in trouble for with work because I am out of FMLA time. Um, basically, I was warned that if I take any time, I would lose my job. That's long story short. Um. So. Well, fast forward to basically about, what will it be, about two weeks ago, uh, Tiny and Mikey both came down with a cough and a cold. Uh, by the time they got tested for RSV, theirs came back inconclusive. I never thought, I thought it was a yes or no test, I don't know. The doctor said it's sim it could be just that the sample um, just wasn't handled correctly. But anyways, Maddie on um, February 8th started coughing, sneezing, having a hard time breathing. Um, we called the emergency room uh, before we left just to kind of let them know that we were coming in and we were told if we could hold off until morning um, because they were so packed that it unfortunately our only choice was to call an ambulance for her to quickly be seen or she needed to be where her POSX was what the POSX was I th think had, it had to be kind of low which obviously uh, long story short, hers was actually very low. Um, we ended up bringing her Sunday morning and it was 84. Uh, um, it went as high as 89. So it was really, the oxygen level was very low for her. Um, they confirmed that she had RSV, um, but they sent us home. Well, the next day we had an appointment with her GI specialist and her nutritionist. Now, keep in mind that we've been dealing with her weight. Well, they decided to hospitalize her for the RSV and for her weight because they said, unfortunately, if she's trying to put on weight, trying to get over RSV, it's just not going to be... It, it, they didn't think it was going to end up being productive, having her just kind of fight it on her own. Uh, they weren't sure why the hospital had us go home, but uh, they said, you're staying. <laughs> so we stayed. Um, it is now, and this was February 10th, it is now almost February 20th. She's still not home. I'll do a full video on her whole stay there, um, but as of right now, I'm just going to kind of let you guys know she should be home tomorrow which will be the 20th which will mean yes she has been in the hospital for 10 full days and she isn't coming home completely fine she's coming home with a feeding tube um, which I can explain that uh, in a nice long video and will also be explained in her six month update um, her five month update will be posted I'm always a month behind but <laughs> Yeah, so thank you guys for keeping Maddie in your thoughts and prayers, and <sighs> sorry, <laughs> if you've ever had a little one in the hospital more than a day or two, you'd know the level of exhaustion that I have, so I will talk to you guys later. Bye.